No, but it's really fat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold up, hold up. No, no, it's fat. I'm telling you, all we need to do is drop a fat beat for the clubs. I'm telling you, they're going to lose their mind. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You say no, 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 no. So the Destiny Child thing came about. Um, I think we had the same product manager at the time, Stephanie Gell. Stephanie Gell told me, you know, there's these girls, they're incredible, you gotta go check them, you know? I knew they came from Texas. This is how far my brain thinks. I like Texas, they moving like no limit soldiers. What if I can have Beyonce sing in the double timing, almost like she's rhyming, like the dudes from Texas at the time? Because everything was going Everything was double timing, but you never you never heard girls doing that. It was impossible. It probably was strange to the label in the beginning because this didn't exist yet. From what I saw, this is gonna go from a dream to the young supremes. It went from a dream to the young supreme singing girl. I remember performing every night with Destiny Child. We was on tour. And I always remember at times, Beyonce on the side of the stage, like, I am me like a hawk. Like just her, her, her idea of just wanting to learn and be part of the culture, every part of the game, she was gonna study it and figure it out. So I was like, this is an amazing person. Like you could see what the future was gonna be. So I'm just lucky to have been fortunate enough to have seen a lot of people like from the start that's how I know these kids today have great, great potential.